I am Victor Nilo Tire Patacone Jr., a college instructor teaching technology courses at Pat's College of Aeronautics, Philippines. In March 2020, our place was put on lockdown due to COVID-19 pandemic. During that time, I decided to learn new skills that will be essential to online learning. That is when I started to appreciate Google applications. I totally support the mission of Google, which is to organize the world's information and make it universally accessible and useful. That's why I decided to video record my experiences in taking Google Educator certifications and the skills I learned from Google Apps. I uploaded those videos on my YouTube channel and organized them so students and teachers will be able to learn in a reasonable time at their own pace. That initiative opened a lot of opportunities for me, both personally and professionally. I was invited to numerous speaking engagements to share my experiences in Google Educator certifications and to hold trainings for teachers in using G Suite apps. Today, I am applying to become a certified Google trainer. I believe that the trainers community will push and help me become my best version. The exclusive materials that will be shared with trainers and the PLN I will be connecting with will help me become more impactful and inspiring trainer. At this point, Please allow me to demo a Google app that I love using because it allows my students to communicate, collaborate, be creative, develop their own character, and practice critical thinking with the use of digital objects on a dynamic white space. This app is called Jamboard. Before using this, it is recommended to provide introduction of the tools so students will know what to do. For example, I would like my students to share with me their expectations during a synchronous meeting on Google Meet. I will click the More Options symbol, then select Whiteboard. I will choose Start a new whiteboard on this pop-up. As we can see, a new jam has been created. It is advisable to put the instructions on the image that will be uploaded as background so the students will not accidentally move or delete them. I already created the image with instructions. I will click the Set Background button, then select Upload Image option. I will click the Browse button, select the image, then click the Open button. As it says here, my students need to use a sticky note. It is best to demo first how the students will do it to be properly guided. I will click the sticky note, then write my own expectation. I can also change its color. After writing my expectation, I will click the Save button. Once instructions are clear, it is time to share the jam. To do that, I will click the Share button. We can share this jam to specific email addresses, or we can go to the Get Link area to change the permission. I will click the Change Link. For my demo today, I will choose our school domain, then select Editor. Once Editor access is set, then the students will be able to put their answers. Thanks for your time.